This amazing outpouring of interest in this election has been sparked partly by the candidates, but as much by the times as anything else. We know our country needs to change, don't we? Yeah. We all know that. And our country will change. The question is, how will we change and how will it affect your lives and your future? That is the great test here. My arguments for Hillary are arguments I would be making if we had never been married. Based on what I know about the presidency it's, and, and its perils, and what I know about this country, I, I work all over America now in a totally non-political way. You know, I work on trying to get the 28 million Americans who get a check every two weeks but don't have a bank account into the banking system, so they don't have to spend hundreds and hundreds of extra dollars on alternative banking transactions. I work on childhood obesity and this rampant rise in childhood diabetes, so we don't have a generation of young people dying before their time. My office in Harlem works on trying to help small businesses take root and thrive in inner cities all across America. And I work around the world. I work in, I, I sell the world's cheapest AIDS medicine in 71 countries. It keeps 1.2 million people alive all around the world. We have a development and healthcare projects in Africa, Latin America, Asia, and in 40 cities on six continents, we're proving you can fight global warming in a way that creates jobs. So I see what's going on in the world and what's going on in America. I would be here for her if we'd never been married because I believe she is, bar none, the best candidate for president I've had a chance to support.